No grill? No problem. You can make this smothered barbecued chicken right on the stovetop. Before we smother the chicken in barbecue sauce, tomatoes, bacon, cheese, and scallions, we start with a dry rub to season and tenderize it. Up to 36 hours before you plan to cook, sprinkle the chicken with salt, pepper, paprika, cumin, and garlic powder. Flip them over and coat the other side with the same mixture, and then store the meat covered in the fridge to allow the salt and the spices to work their magic. When you're ready to cook, heat a large skillet to medium high and cook the bacon first until browned and crisp, and then transfer the cooked bacon to a plate lined with paper towels. Turn off the heat and carefully remove all but about two tablespoons of bacon drippings from the pan, and then turn the heat back up to medium high and sear the chicken on both sides. You may want to cover the pan to help keep the heat inside and cook the chicken a little faster. This is especially helpful when you have a thick piece of meat like I had and will minimize the chances of burning the outside before the inside is cooked through. When the chicken is about two to three minutes from being done, brush or pour on the barbecue sauce, then begin the layering of tomato slices and bacon, then smother it with the shredded cheese and finish with a sprinkle of scallions. To help the cheese melt, put a lid on top, or if the chicken is too tall for the lid like mine was, you can make a tent out of foil to trap in the heat. Or you can put the whole thing in the oven under the broiler for about one to two minutes and that'll make the cheese a little browned and crispy on top. You can find the recipe for this smothered barbecued chicken at homewithshay.com. Shay Ryan, ABC Action News.